Hi, my name's Karma. Welcome to my channel, Karma of Omanent. Today we're going to be doing a box on opening for a brand new box. This is my first subscription from them. And it's called the Cosmic Crystal Box. Now what I'm doing is I'm trying to get about three different crystal boxes, maybe four, and do a contrast and compare on them. But um, right now, we're just gonna be talking about the Cosmic Crystal Box. Now the Cosmic Crystal Box can be found on CrateJoy.com or can be found on their own site. Uh, and I will link their site below um, so that you can find them if you're interested in this box. This box runs $20.95 a month plus shipping. So the actual cost per month comes out to $26.95 for me here in Arizona. Um, it bills on the 11th of the month. And the description, of course, is crystals. Um, but it doesn't give you a number. Much meant, bleh, like other boxes, some of them will tell you you get five crystals or that kind of thing. This one says, can include one large crystal or a combination of smaller points, rust stones, clusters, raw specimens, or polished stones. So, um, and I did just see a video that she did um, a couple of days ago where she said she hasn't ever done only one stone in a box, but if it were a really big, nice, expensive stone, then it could be one stone. So, this is what the boxes look like when you get them. That's about the size. We have the pretty crystals on each side. Um, it did come shipped USPS, so did end up in my mailbox, which is kind of a pain because we don't have one outside our house. We have to go and get it um, at least with this box where it's crystals we don't have as much problem with the heat when it's some of the other boxes that have beauty products in and if it happens to catch you when you're off camping for a weekend or something it can be kind of yucky when you get back so crystals aren't such a big deal so when you open up the box this is what it looks like and you've got these cards on the top that we'll look at and then the crystals are underneath So um, let's just look and see what crystals we have, what we have in the box, and then I'll read the descriptions. Kind of noticing on some of the videos um, that most people aren't watching all the way through. And I thought, well, maybe if I show just the items in the box, that way if that's all you're here to do is see really quickly what's in the box, you can get that really fast. Then if you want the descriptions, um, you can continue on to part two. So in the box, first let's pull out, we have a little baggie here. And it looks like it's got a little necklace in. Now, I do know that she had said that um, on your first box is when you would get a necklace. So, here's the little necklace. Looks like green adventuring to me. It's really pretty. It is new. I mean, it is uh, real. You can tell because of the variations in the gem. Not just a plastic piece, which is nice. Then we have a nice size rose quartz. There you go. Looks like we have a quartz crystal point. It's a fairly nice size one. kind of a raw end on one end. And then we have, last but not least, a nicely wrapped amethyst piece. Really pretty. You can see the sparkling off all there. And then it's wrapped in some tissue and it's got, looks like the back is, you know, got the more um, outside of the geode kind of a look to it. Let me pull this off. Yeah. So it's just protecting especially those side pieces that can come off really easily. So that's why it was wrapped in tissue. You can see it's got the back part of the geode there. Very nice. Really nice piece. So that's what's in the box this month. Now I do have to tell you that 
I ordered the box like in mid-June, I want to say, and this box did arrive on June 30th. So I'm thinking that she might have sent me a June box and that I'll still get a July box, but I'm not quite sure, so we'll just have to wait and see. So if all you wanted to see was what was in the box, thanks for coming. So with the descriptions, let's start with the Adventurine card. You can see it's just a nice card that tells you. It says, let me get my glasses. Where did I put them? There they are. Adventurine. Green Adventurine is known as the sto Stone of Opportunity. Thought to be the luckiest of all crystals, especially in manifesting prosperity and wealth. Adventurine is also the stone of opportunity and opening doors to new ventures. So, a lot of people out looking in the job market for a job right now. This would be a beautiful piece then for you to wear to help you or tuck it inside your wallet or your purse if you were going on a job interview. The next card we have is the Amethyst card. And that was this beautiful piece of amethyst. And it says, Amethyst is a meditative and calming stone which works in the emotional, spiritual, and physical planes to promote calm, balance, and peace. It is believed to act to activate the mind and assist in clairvoyance and intuition. Um, I will say one thing about their cards if you look at them. The ink is in the same color as the um, art splotch on there, so it makes them a little bit hard to read. Now, I admit I'm getting older, so that's just something probably when I was young wouldn't have bothered me at all, but today it makes it a little harder to read. Then we have, let's look at the quartz crystal, and the card for the quartz crystal. And that says, clear quartz is a master healer crystal. Crystal quartz amplifies whatever energy or intent it is programmed is programmed into it and continues to broadcast that energy. Clear quartz produces a force field of healing negative ions while clearing the surrounding positive ions, protecting the aura, helping one to have clear crystal thoughts. Crystal clear thoughts, sorry. So with the quartz crystal, you can put this with anything that you're working with. Quartz will always amplify whatever stone it is that you're working with. So, and last but not least, the piece of rose quartz. And it, it's on the back, there's the card on the front that was saw, and then on the back is where it has the description for the quartz crystal. So rose quartz, sorry, I said quartz crystal, I meant rose quartz which is a quartz crystal, just rose, uh, purifies and opens the heart at all levels to promote love, self-love, friendship, deep inner healing, and feelings of peace, encourages self-forgiveness and acceptance, effective in attracting new love, romance, and intimacy, or in developing a closer bond with family or friends. Rose quartz is a calming and reassuring crystal, excellent for use in trauma and crisis. It's for the heart chakra, it's a Taurus and Libra zodiac sign and vibration number, it says one. So um, I use a lot of rose quartz in my crystal grids. Um, I, it's one of my favorite stones. Uh, I don't think we can have too much love in the world and too much love for one another, especially during these times. So that's a beautiful stone. So we've got those three stones. And then the little gift as a new subscriber. So this gift is for the new subscriber. These would be the three stones that would have been found in the box. Now I do want to give boxes a few months. Um, I would look at something like this and go, this would be great for a beginner. Um, but these are probably three of the most common crystals that you're going to have and use. So it's always great to have more. Uh, but I kind of want to see as we go on with these boxes, are we just getting the most common crystals and um, that kind of thing. So super happy and excited for my new crystals. I'll be working with them in the near future and hope you enjoyed the video.